Hello, Aries. Happy Earth Day. Happy birthday. Let me get my uh, straw and my drink. Just in case my throat chakra start acting up. How y'all doing? How y'all feeling? How's your birthday season treating you? Anyway, this is um, a lunar eclipse energy tap in, okay? We gonna check in. Anyway, the lunar eclipse in Libra, okay, is on Monday, March 25th. Okay, the most affected signs that will be affected by this lunar eclipse is you, Cancer, Libra, and Capricorn. You can have any of those other three in your chart somewhere, okay? Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Mercury, North Node, South Node, Pluto, uh, Neptune. What else is it? Jupiter. I don't know. Anywhere, but these, those are, you guys are cardinal signs, okay? The Aries, Cancer, Libra, and Capricorn. So, you were born to be a leader. You're a born leader, I'm hearing, okay? But for you, okay, well, overall, generally, um, a lunar eclipse presents a potent opportunity for purifying our emotional state and establishing intentions for, for re revitalization. Market periods of faded transformation and spiritual growth, okay? And if you have Capricorn in your chart, you are really lucky with this lunar eclipse, okay? But Aries, for you, big changes is how you relate to others, okay? It's time for reflection on connections. Sort out any lingering emotions from the past. Finding inner peace and miss these shifts, okay? So embrace it. Okay, encountering unexpected opportunities in finances, it is y'all season. Okay, listen to y'all instincts and be open to new opportunities. Remember, change is normal and can lead to growth. Okay, so let's see signs of the times for y'all. Let's see what's going on, what y'all need to know. How y'all feeling? I hope you guys are enjoying your season. So let's see what's going on for Aries. What does Aries need to know, Holy Spirit? Okay. Succulence, resilience. Okay. You're being resilient at this time, or you might be feeling the, ch the change of being more resilient. 38. You could be that age, or and the number 11 could be insignificant. Okay. Something to do with flowers or something like that. Lotus flowers in particular. Okay. We're in a number five. Okay. Phase of uh, phrases. Being more motivated. Okay. Never give up. Spirit is saying. You could be 24 or the number six. Or the number two. Me a significant. Okay. Something about a banner. And something else. What is that? That looked like 246. Opportunities, okay? A key of opportunity. Number 17, number 8, the number 6, again. Keys open doors, okay? So when one door closes, another one opens. This over here. Sorry, ladies and gents. Let me see. Ooh. They've got a lot to tell y'all. And something about distractions, okay? The number 11 is here. You could be seeing that. The number two as well. Let me get one more for Aries, Holy Spirit. During this lunar eclipse. Labyrinth, journey, okay? The number 15, the number six again, the number four, okay? And angel numbers. You could be seeing a lot of angel numbers. This is your confirmation, Okay, so something about your, your journey, okay, maybe you realizing uh, about distractions, okay, that's holding you back, okay, that's keeping you from opportunities, okay, but Spirit said, it's part of the journey, never give up on yourself, okay, you're resilient, you know how to move, you know what to do, okay, let me see. What is it? Ooh. Something about great passion, okay? 
your resilience. Something about a tulip. You could like tulips. You could just like flowers overall or God or God or the universe is trying to give you your flowers while you're able to receive, okay? Unsuccessful plans, okay? The knot. It's been a knot. You've been stuck, okay? But Spirit saying is never give up, even though it's been uns unsuccessful. Remember, when one door closes, another one opens, okay? And it says, do not be tempted to lower your standards, okay? When it comes to opportunities, okay, because you never know what you're going to get. I'm hearing life is like a box of chocolates. You never know what you're going to get, okay? You could be watching uh, Forrest Gump or like that movie or somebody named is Tom. Tommy, I'm hearing. What is this distractions, this clouds for Aries? New attitude, new home, broom, okay? Maybe you've been distracted on an opportunity to be in a new home or something like that. Or or um, spirit is like moving things out of your way so you're able to get a new home or a new attitude or something. I got a new attitude. What is the journey? Oh, that's too much on this that is too much. Something about nest. Nesting. So you guys could be pregnant. You could be nesting. Okay. What is this journey? Bird flying. <clears throat> news is on the way. Okay. You guys got some news on the way coming towards you. Something about a eagle's eye or rising phoenix or something. Let's see. What is this tulip? Oh, you know what? I forgot. Something about thank you for being a friend. Something about Golden Girls, okay? It could be guys, whatever. Maybe you like that show, okay? But something about thank you for being a friend. Dun -dun 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 -dun. Back again. A heart in, mm, you're a pal and a confidant. Mm -mm. And if you threw a party and invited everyone you knew, thank you for being a friend. Okay, somebody wants to thank you for being a friend or you them. Okay, I don't know what that was in my background. It sounded like some shots being fired i don't know something about a motorcycle yes yeah, some something is coming towards y'all what is this Re succulence resilience this tulip great passion for aries yeah partying okay you something about celebrating which we know is show birth day okay but something about celebrating with friends family okay cake ice cream something that brings you great passion you're gonna be celebrating okay not just for your birthday but something something big is happening okay so spirit is saying embrace this change it will help you grow okay what is this uh, phrases motivation not of unsex unsexful plan i'll say unsexful <laughs> Unsuccessful plans for Aries. Thank you. Yeah. Never give up, okay? Will of Fortune. Maybe you haven't had a great success in something that you really wanted, but Spirit is saying, be patient. Patience is a virtue. It's going to work out in your favor because the card is right side up, okay? You're about to be receiving everything that you want. Even, as I said, when one door closes, another one opens, and it's going to be everything that you ever prayed for, that you ever wanted or something like that, okay? So just be patient. Spirit got you, okay? What is this? key of opportunities and flag do not be tempted to lower your standards or you're gonna miss out on your blessing i'm hearing okay it could be a key to a new house okay or a new car or something like that or a key to a business okay a key to success yes you need to be defensive to what is not 
was trying to distract you, okay? It could be one, two, three, four, five, six, six, six energies around you that's distracting you from what you need to be paying attention to, okay? To this opportunity. Oh, I'm feeling it like y'all need to have y'all guards up, okay? It's time to buckle down, I'm hearing. Okay, I'm feeling happy for y'all, Aries. What is this clouds and distractions? Boom, new attitude. I got a new attitude. Something's gonna make you have a new attitude, okay? Ooh, that's too much. What does Aries thank you? Six of Pentacles. Something about giving. Somebody could be giving y'all a new home. Keys to a new home or keys to a car or something like that. As a gift. Okay. Okay, Aries. You're going to be receiving something, okay? What is this Six of Pentacles for Aries? Happiness, Empress, okay? Somebody could be pregnant or um, somebody could be getting married or this is wife, wifey, hubby, baby daddy, baby mama, okay? Something happy, okay? New home, new life, I'm hearing, okay? New husband, new wife. Something receiving, okay? Something that's balanced. Boom. New attitude. <laughs> Congratulations. What is this journey bird flying? For Aries. Nine of Cups. Something that's wish fulfillment. You about to be receiving some type of news, okay? Something that's making you feel good. You could be single as well. Okay, what is this line of cups? Page of Wands. Something that's minute, I'm hearing. Okay, something that's going to be wish, fulfill, wish fulfillment for you. Maybe you trying to be single. Work on a new you or something. Okay? Slow and steady. Something is coming in slow and steady, but you about to receive some type of news. Something that's going to make you happy. Okay? Look how she's smiling. Okay? Knight of Cups. Let me see. Something to do with the lovers, okay? Something that's that's a divine union, okay? Page of Cups. Some type of apology or it's some, uh, something to do with a pregnancy or something. What is this? It's coming in slow and steady, okay? I don't know, but Spirit is also saying it is a time for giving, Rather than, it's a time to give rather than a take or something. I'm all in the lunar eclipse way. Whatever it is, it's a it's a new opportunity, okay? Something that's going to help you grow, okay? All right, Aries, that's sweet. That's dope. What does Aries need to know? Holy Spirit. What is lunar, ooh, lunar eclipse. Have faith in your dreams, okay? Something about the waxing moon and your hard work is paying off, okay? No moon in Capricorn. Like I said, if you might have Capricorn in your chart. Okay, Aries, whatever is going on, just embrace the change. It is all for you, okay, babies? I'll get back with y'all. Peace.